with the transfer window finally coming to a close and Chelsea doing brilliantly well in transfer markets with the signing of Lukaku, Sao Niguez on deadline day as well as Marcos Bettinelli from Fulham in a free, Chelsea have had an impressive start of the season winning the UEFA Super Cup and currently sitting fourth in the Premier League log table after impressive displays against Crystal Palace, Arsenal and Liverpool. Chelsea beating Crystal Palace 3-0, beating Arsenal 2-0 and man and settled for a draw against Liverpool which saw Chelsea played out that game a 1-1 draw with 10 men all through the second half of the game. Well, with that said, we take a good look at Chelsea's squad and what could look like a brilliant transfer business by Mariana and the board. The Chelsea squad depth is really really unique and awesome from the from the goalkeeping department we've got Mendy, Kepa and Marcos Petnelli in that order. The three-man defense which is always Thomas Tuku most preferred defense line we've got Rudiga and Chaloba on the right side in the middle we've got Siva and Christensen on the left side we've got Aspiculeta and James the on the right side rather Aspiculeta and James then coming to the midfield where Chelsea has so much power in we've got Giorgio for Ansao we've got Kante and Kovacic also we've got James and Hudson Odoi Chiwell and Alonso you could see every position has at least two two in it and going up front in the attack we've got Lukaku and Timoena we've got Mount and Pulisic Havertz and Ziyech all in one squad wow this Chelsea squad is really really unique and really really awesome this, this squad Chelsea's first team Chelsea's second team can win the Premier League on its day and this is very 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 strong i can't really remember the last time chelsea had this kind of strong squad this is really really awesome from chelsea from the board from mariana sao adding to the midfield which gives kante so much time to rest just currently knowing now that kante is almost like injury prone that is his knee his ankle has not really healed well but Kante will always be the best Chelsea have but with Sao Kante can get some rest and Sao can deputize for Kante I'd like to know what you what you think about this squad and what you think will be Thomas Tuchel's best preferred team lineup going into this new season as the season go in full, full swing after the international break and if this is your first time here on our channel remember to click on the subscribe button click on the bell icon to get notified whenever i drop you new videos